when you have a hard time or you're struggling with something, what kinds of things do you tell yourself to get through it? If a friend of yours said that they were having a hard time, what kind of things would you tell them to be supportive? Hi, I'm Courtney Cuthbertson and I'm an extension specialist with University of Illinois. In today's moment for mental health, we are going to talk about self-compassion. Self-compassion is the idea that you extend the same kindness, support, and encouragement to yourself that you would offer to someone else. The questions I asked in the beginning of what you would tell yourself if you were struggling compared to what you might tell a friend, when we think about these questions, many people find that they are a lot nicer to their friends than they are to themselves. We might be tempted to tell ourselves something like, try harder, or that's not good enough, or buck up, or stop complaining. These kinds of thoughts are holding ourselves to very high standards and can be judgmental or criticizing. Experiencing a hard time does not mean that we are a bad person, and it does not mean that we are a failure as human beings. Engaging in self-compassion would mean that we shift our language to identify that we are having a hard time and instead to be kind to ourselves rather than criticizing. That might look like saying to ourselves something like, wow, this is really hard, or I'm doing my best, or I am struggling with this and that's okay, I will try again later, or I am struggling and I am not defined by what I struggle with. Self-compassion is a practice. This means that it is something that we have to actively do and try and that we might try many times before we feel like we're getting the hang of it. And in the beginning, it can be hard. That's okay. If you're interested in learning more about self-compassion, Dr. Kristen Neff has conducted research studies as well as workshops about it and her website can be found at selfcompassion.org. That is self hyphen compassion.org. Her website includes guided videos and exercises for you to try. The next time things get tough, I encourage you to try on self-compassion. Ask yourself, what would I say to a friend who is dealing with this? How can I be my own best supporter? I hope you join us next time for another moment for mental health.